I'm good, Joe. Please be seated. Veuillez vous asseoir. The court is now in session. L'audience est ouverte. Today we will continue to hear the testimony of the witness Sum Alad. À entendre la déposition du témoin Sum Alad. And before we hand the floor to the prosecution, I'd like to get confirmation la from Kyle Sum Pond's defense regarding the chamber's query yesterday so that we can prepare the schedule Hier, for la next chambre week. A indiqué qu'elle voulait pouvoir Could you please give us your confirmation? Prochaine. Est-ce que la défense de Kyle Sum Pond peut faire part de sa décision Oui, j'en ai déjà fait part euh, à votre yes, greffier, Monsieur le Président. Euh, je pensais qu'il vous l'aurait dit. Effectivement, bien, euh, nous utiliserons à bon escient officer. la demi-journée que la Chambre a fixée. We shall use the half day that the trial chamber has allocated for us. Le Président, Thank you very much for your merci beaucoup pour cette confirmation. The chamber would like now to give the floor présent, to the prosecution to continue putting questions to this witness. You may proceed. Le good morning, Mr. President. Bonjour, Monsieur good morning, Your Honours. Good morning, Council. And good morning, uh, Mr. Sum. Bonjour à vous, Monsieur Sum. <coughs> Today, I'd like to ask you a few questions about your role um, in the uh, in the conflict between 1970 and 1975 in Cambodia, and uh, you, you gave a brief overview to your state uh, to the investigators uh, from the ECC a number of years ago. And if I can just quote you that and ask you some questions about what you said to them. Et vous interrogez sur ce At que vous avez dit. Et en French, 0027 4129. In your statement, you said this. What did, when asked the question, what did you do before 1975? Where did you live? I finished my education in 1972 and I joined the infantry of the SAT provincial subdivision in the same year. At that time, I was a lower rank officer as corporal, one stripe. I worked at a provincial staff office. I participated in the battlefield in Phnom Kravan district. It was the heaviest battlefield in 1973. Then we moved our base and took thousands of residents in Leech, area of Kravan district, to the Sat province. In 1973, I worked in the provincial staff again. And in April 1975, my commander sent me to work in the mortar unit at Sfei Dunkeo Bridge Battlefield. I returned to Pasat, provincial town, when the Khmer Rouge took control over the province. My first question is, uh, is it correct that you were 16 when the war started in Cambodia and 21 years old when the uh, Khmer Rouge took over Pasat province. The age that you refer to is incorrect. C'est inexact. Thank you. So in 1970, how old were you? In 1970, 
J'avais 19 ou 20 ans. J'avais déjà passé mon examen. Thank you. When you joined um, the infantry in 1972, um, did you belong to a particular company or battalion or unit? À une compagnie, un bataillon, une unité. When I joined the army, quand j'ai intégré l'armée, on the Lonnol side, it was the provincial Dans le camp de Lonnol, c'était une sous-division provinciale. And in French, I was called état-major of the province, and it was located in the provincial town office. C'était au bureau provincial. And when you were not in the battlefield, what was the particular Question. job you did Quand vous for the, the de uh, military then? Que faisiez-vous pour l'armée? I was Réponse. an état-major staff at the comme on dit en français, provincial staff office. Au bureau provincial, l'interprète répète ce qu'il entend. C'était le premier, deuxième, troisième bureau. Je faisais partie du bureau opérationnel. So you had a, a good overview of what was happening militarily Donc vous saviez ce qui se passait sur le plan militaire dans la province de Pourcette. Par exemple, quand vous étiez au bureau. Uh, what military activity Vous étiez au courant securing, des activités militaires where military units were based. et du lieu où étaient basées les unités militaires. L'interprète précise que le terme employé en français était « état-major ». À l'époque où j'étais au bureau de l'état-major, la situation était Certains secteurs étaient contrôlés par les Khmers Il y avait eu des combats à différents endroits. Vous avez dit qu'en 1973, dans le district de Phnom Kravan, il y a eu les combats les plus violents. Was that battlefield à quelle distance from environ the Passat, se trouvait uh, provincial town? ce théâtre d'opération par rapport à la ville de Pursat Apparemment, Phnom Krovan était dans le district appelé Leach, à plus de 30 km de la ville de Pursat. Tous les gens avaient été envoyés à la ville de Pursat en 1973. And um, who sent them Question. to live in that town? Was Qui it the, the Lonnol envoyés? forces or was it the les forces uh, de revolutionary forces? Ou celle de la Revolution? Who made them move? Qui les a ainsi transférés? There was an order from Réponse. the upper level Un ordre a été rendu that is en haut on lieu. the Lonnol military side. Dans le camp de l'armée de Lonnol. And was that because you were losing the battle Question. in that area? Était-ce parce que vous étiez en train de perdre la bataille dans cette région? I could not know the real reason, but Je n'en connaissais pas les motifs réels, mais j'ai su que l'ordre était venu d'en haut, de Phnom Penh. 
Thank you. And between Question. 1973 and 1975 in Passat, uh, were there many battlefields throughout the province? Dans la de y de théâtres d'opération? The events that occurred in Pusat province at that time was the gradual dans la province de withdrawal or re retreat from the Krovang district Il y avait and une also those from Kroko district, district was also withdrawn until the day of the 17 April Il y a eu une battue en retraite jusqu'au 17 avril 17 avril où cela a cessé and <coughs> question are you able to say um, before the 17th of April avant le 17 avril um, say before the Khmer, Khmer Rouge took control over the province que les Khmer about Rouge how many ne prennent contrôle um, de la province front lines were there combien what de lignes de front, front lines y what length were the battles environ quelle était la longueur de la ligne de front At that time, Réponse. the town front line was extended to La about 30 kilometers from the provincial town. S'étendait sur 30 kilometers autour de la ville de Pursat. Uh, did the front line Question. surround this uh, 30 kilometer um, distance? Did that front line surround the town with Khmer Rouge forces? Or was it only on Encerclé. one side or two sides or three ville, sides? Est-ce que les Khmer Rouges encerclaient la ville ou bien est-ce qu'ils n'étaient positionnés que d'un côté ou que de deux côtés de cette ville? Please repeat your question. Réponse. Pourriez-vous répéter? Um, you said question. before. Um, the Khmer Rouge Vous dites qu'avant uh, la prise de Pursat pouvoir province, des Khmer Rouge de la province de Pursat, was about 30 la ligne de front était from, à une trentaine uh, town. de kilomètres um, de la ville de Pursat. Est-ce que cette uh, ligne circle, de front um, Pursat encerclait town, la ville de Pursat ou bien est-ce qu'elle était seulement au nord, or the west, au sud, à l'est, à l'ouest de la ville ou à deux endroits en même temps, par exemple. There were battlefields at various districts. Il y avait des champs de bataille dans and différents also districts. Ainsi qu'autour de la capitale provinciale. Les gradually les Khmer Rouges approchaient progressivement de la ville. So Il y avait des combats. Had been evacuated, but the battlefields did not rage only within the provincial town, but uh, it also happened at various other districts in the province. Dans le chef -lieu de province mais également dans d'autres districts de la province. <coughs> Is it fair to say then Question. that um, Donc, shortly before the sat was taken over by the Khmer Rouge, the municipality, de uh, there were many de battlefields being fought in the avait beaucoup de combats dans la province. At that time, réponse. There had been no more battlefields after the Khmer Rouge took control of the provincial town because by that time the soldiers were disarmed or surrendered. Car à ce moment-là, les soldats ont été désarmés ou se sont rendus. Question. Yes, but shortly before the Khmer Rouge took control of the province, was there a lot of fighting in different battlefields? Was there a lot of fighting in different battlefields? Was there a lot of fighting in different battlefields? Was there a lot of fighting in different battlefields? sur différents champs de bataille dans la municipalité avant cette prise de contrôle. 
Yes, indeed. Réponse. Oui. Immediately before the Khmer Rouge took control, Juste avant la prise de contrôle par les Khmer Rouges, in various, uh, battles. il y a eu des combats violents à différents endroits. <coughs> Thank you. I, I'd now like question. To ask you a few questions à présent, about, um, je vais poser quelques questions this event where you were required to sur la foi And you talk about that. où In, in your statement. Vous avez été désarmé. And if Vous I en read that portion of the statement to you, I would like to ask you a few questions about what you said to the ECC investigators. Puis je vais vous interroger là-dessus. <coughs> This is at E English 0024 Khmer 0019 68, and French 09, et en 0027 0027 4129. You were asked this question. La question posée était la suivante. What did you do on the 17th of April 1975? Where did you live? In April 1975, I was removed from the mortar unit to Passat provincial town. At that time, the Khmer Rouge took control over Passat province. Les Khmer Rouges ont pris contrôle the Lonnol's army in Passat province de received an instruction from Phnom Penh to disarm Penh from May Sean, Brigadier General, through an announcement on radio. When we disarmed, the Khmer Rouge continued to fire and spray towards us from both sides of the National Road. The Khmer Rouge troops who fired towards us were those hidden in the jungle. They fired and sprayed at any direction to either human or animal target. I spent one day to walk from Svei Dankeo to Trapang Chon in Bakan district. Um, did all of the Lodnol units in Passat, in the province, to your knowledge, have access to uh, military radios? d'un appareil radio militaire I don't quite get your question. Réponse. Je n'ai pas saisi la question. Please repeat. Pourriez-vous répéter um, You mentioned question. that um, the order, the instruction to disarm from Phnom Penh came through in an announcement on the radio. Was that um, a publicly available radio? Or was that just a radio only available to the Lon Nol forces? Or was that just a radio only available to the Lon Nol forces? Yes, I The radio announcements was made uh, nationally. It was a national event a and it was a, a national broadcast. Ça a été un événement national diffusé it dans tout le pays. that we representing the general staff of Phnom Penh, May Si Chon, wishes to make the announcement to all the army to surrender by raising the white flag and to lay down et en déposant les armes, all units must toutes les unités devaient respecter cette instruction, disait-on à la radio. Do you remember where Question. You were when you heard that announcement? Vous rappelez-vous où vous étiez en entendant cette annonce? I clearly réponse. recall that I Je m'en souviens in bien. Sway Don Kao, where my unit was based. Où était stationnée mon unité? And just so we know, question. Sway Don Kao, is that how how far away is that from the town of Pusat? And in which direction? And in which direction? 
par rapport à cette Swai ville Donc, is the réponse border Swai of Osaka and Battenborn. It was situated along national road number 5. It was numéro to the west of the provincial town and it was about 30 kilometers away from the provincial town. De kilomètres de celle-ci. Thank you. That was a, a very clear answer. You, Merci. you talked about disarming and then the Khmer Rouge continued to fire les armes et um, les Khmer Rouge indiscriminately at you. Um, were the Khmer Rouge forces aware que that you had disarmed Khmer at that stage? Que vous aviez les armes à ce moment -là? Le président, president of Vietnam's Peace attendre. Counselor La parole Victor est à Maître Copé. La défense. Um, thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Good Monsieur morning. le Président. Bonjour. Objection. 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 Talk about Ce témoin of surrender flags. I don't know. pourrait uh, I'm parler not asking to de drapeau blanc, par um, exemple. The, Je ne lui demande pas de mettre des suppositions. À l'époque, il était sur le champ de bataille et peut-être qu'il dispose d'informations. Peut-être qu'il sait ces choses. Ce n'est certes pas dans le mais ce n'est pas pourtant une supposition. And, um, il he était en mesure de savoir. Where, il avait déposé les armes et peut-être qu'il sait si les Khmer Rouge le savaient. En fonction du comportement des Khmer Rouges, peut-être que le témoin pourrait nous en informer. Ce ne sont pas des suppositions. Il était sur place lors du désarmement. Les Khmer Rouges étaient là aussi. L'objection est rejetée. We need to hear the response by la Chambre the souhaite witness to the last question la put to him témoin. by the prosecutor. Witness, please respond to the last question. Mr. President, I would Le like témoin. to consult with my duty counsel. Consulter mon President. Le Président. Mr. Witness, this Monsieur question does not incriminate you, and if you cannot recall the question, you may ask si the question to be question, repeated. And the prosecution, maybe the witness cannot recall the last question, le so please put the question to him again. La question, la Thank you. Um, perhaps Merci. I'll rephrase it. Je vais la reformuler. When when your unit heard the announcement Quand to disarm on the radio, à la radio comme um, quoi il fallait se was, did désarmer, that, did you communicate that to the Khmer Rouge forces that were firing at you? Did you let Rouge them know that you were disarming? Avez-vous fait savoir que vous déposiez les armes? Réponse. On this matter, when the announcement on the radio for us to this time, au moment de l'annonce in the faite à la radio, evening, quoi nous we were facing the Khmer Rouge force. Eh bien, durant la soirée. In fact, we laid down our arms in the evening and then nous avons we joined les armes in the dancing event together. Et nous sommes allés but danser by ensemble. next morning, the thing was matin, completely different because by était the morning, différente. they armed en themselves effet, and le matin, we raised our white flag. Ils ont pris les armes et nous avons and un drapeau blanc. when you raised... Um, your white flag. Question. Quand vous avez did the shooting continue or did it stop? Blanc, que les tirs ont continué ou non? When we raised the white flag, réponse. Quand nous avons agité le drapeau blanc, 
Comme je l'ai dit, evening, durant la soirée, fire, il y a eu un cessez-le-feu. Mais when we au petit walk, matin, while the white alors que nous marchions en arborant District to Bolsat, depuis la situation était complètement event. différente de la veille au soir. And was there any firing in the morning? Le matin, y a-t-il eu des tirs? Alors que nous battions en retraite avec les civils par la route numéro 5, nous avons essuyé des coups de feu provenant des deux côtés de la route. Question. Where you state that you attended a meeting at the Bakan district office, and it's an English 0024-2124, Khmer 0019-6809 and 10, and French 0027-4130. At 7 p.m. of the same day, and that's of the day that um, uh, you disarmed, the Khmeru's troops rounded up about 500 soldiers, residents, and civil servants for a meeting at the Bakan district office. I did not know the name of the Khmeru's chief who presided over that meeting. At that time, I replaced my army uniform with a civilian suit. The content of that meeting was political indoctrination, urging the res residents to leave the provincial town and go to rural areas by saying that such evacuation was to avoid a bombardment by the United States of America. I fled during their meeting with a pistol and spent one night to crawl to stay at. I sneaked in and joined the mobile brigade to dig a canal at Kabal Hong. My first question is, um, how far is the Bakan district office to the center of Pasat, central town? Bureau district de Bakan, du centre de la ville. Response. Bakan is to the west of Bakan the district office. I think it's about 20 kilometers away from this, this office. Um, so the, are you saying that Bakan district office Question is 20 kilometers away from the Passat town. Que le bureau district de Bakan est à une vingtaine de kilomètres de la ville de Pursat. Response. Yes. Oui. How did the Khmer Rouge round up the 500 soldiers Comment les Khmer Rouges ont-ils rassemblé environ ces 500 personnes, fonctionnaires, soldats et habitants Response. I don't know the Réponse. procedures in rounding up uh, these people because by the time I was there, these people had already been gathered. And I was uh, also stopped assemblée. to join them. And can you explain why you went to the, you headed towards the Bakan district office after the disarmament? Response. On the same day, 
as I already mentioned in my statement, Comme je déjà dit, we left uh, Swai Dong Kao and it took us one day before we reached Bakan. And at night, Bakan. by the time we arrived, Le the meeting venu, had already been convened. Comme arrivés, la and déjà été t, um, we were fired at, uh, déjà commencé, and because of this, we had to a spend a whole day traveling from Swaidungao to Bakan. Dessus, et donc, nous avons pris, ça nous a pris une journée pour aller à Bakan depuis Can you explain um, a bit in more detail what was said at the meeting? Question. You said that um, the si content of the meeting was de qui, uh, political indoctrination de la and urging the residents de to leave the provincial town. Les Can you chef explain lieu? more what they said to you? Pouvez-vous nous donner plus de détails? Response. Réponse. I did not pay great attention to the Je event because I was already in fear. I was terrified and I was running for my life. Je voulais sauver ma peau. You said that they um, urged the residents to leave. Vous dites um, qu'on a Did they order people to leave, or was it an invitation? L'ordre aux gens de partir ou les invitait-il à partir? Response. Réponse. It was not an invitation, I can say. It was more or less an order, un, un and people had to sorte. leave. Et les gens devaient partir. And do you know which uh, Khmer Rouge uh, officials uh, were conducting the meeting? Question. Et who was speaking? Qui étaient les personnes qui uh, animaient la réunion? Qui a pris la parole? Response. Réponse. I'm afraid I don't know Je who chaired the meeting. Je ne sais pas qui a présidé la réunion. After Question. Um, this meeting where people were Après asked to leave réunion, um, Passat town, um, did people leave Passat? Les habitants ont-ils quitté Passat? The town center of Passat? Response. Réponse. I'm talking about Bakan as meeting, uh, the meeting at uh, Bakan district, not the district one Bacan, at the provincial town of réunion, Pursat. Uh, au de Pursat. Are you aware if there were many meetings Question. occurring in Pursat province y a eu um, of a similar nature, de Pursat, where people were being asked um, to to leave the area or to leave the provincial town. De la ville. If, you're, if you're not, just say so. Et si vous ne le savez pas, vous n'avez qu'à le dire. Response. Réponse. No, I'm not. Uh, non, je I ne sais only pas. I am aware of the meeting in Bakan district. I am not aware of Bacan, any other meetings uh, conducted elsewhere. Il y a eu I'd now like to talk about um, the evacuation of Passat town. In your statement, um, at uh, English 0024 Zero zero one nine six eight one zero and French zero zero two seven four one three zero. You were asked this question. How was the situation of Passat province when the Khmer Rouge troops took control over the entire province after the 17th of April 1975? You answered, when the Khmer Rouge arrived, I saw the following 
confusing events and incidents. Khmer Rouge troops evacuated people from the provincial town to the countryside. So my first question is, um, how long after the meeting in Bakan district did you see uh, people being evacuated from the provincial town of Pursat? Response. When it comes to that period of time, I left Bakan to for Swayat. It took me the whole day. The atmosphere was rather quiet and calm. I already uh, wrote it down. Nonetheless, some confusion confusing events still existed because people appear to confusion. be of mixed feelings and that evacuation had already been underway. Étaient, so uh, the period of time would be just one day different, I may donc, say, because uh, by the time I reached uh, Posat, uh, when I had left uh, Bakan, Posat town was quiet. When I arrived in the village of Posat after having quitted the district of Bakan, the village was already calm. When you say the town was quiet, had people calme. left the town at that Monsieur stage? Le but, c'est dire que les habitants avaient déjà quitté. Response. I presume they had already left because this event uh, was also uh, common uh, like what had happened previously because people had to leave uh, their place uh, for fear of a bomb being dropped by the United States of America. And where did these people go? The people from Passat Town. Où sont-ils allés, les habitants de Passat Town? Response: I don't know where they had gone because people had gone to different directions, and the only thing I remember precisely is that by the time I reached Posat, the town was empty, and that people had left. But Posat is not a big town, so people could have been sent to just some area in the neighborhood. Donc, il est possible que les gens soient allés Thank non you. loin de là. I'd now like to turn to uh, another meeting that you refer to in your statement, which was held in the Passat Provincial non. Town Hall uh, on about the 24th or 25th of April 1975. In your statement at English 0024 2125 to 6 Khmer 0019 68111 and French 0027 4132 31 and 32 You were asked this question After taking full control over the province after the 17th of April 1975, what did they do to Lon Nol soldiers and civil servants? At that time, Soth, Sector Secretary, called General Pram Lehun, the Passat Provincial Governor, soldiers, civil servants, and students of Lon Nol's regime to meet at the provincial office. There were about 500 attendees, and it was held at about 2 p.m. on the 24th or 25th of April 1975. The content of the meeting was an invitation to receive the Yanka at Tulpotray. There were Khmer Rouge soldiers guarding outside during the meeting, Khmer Rouge chiefs, including Tarsot, who was also attending. 
Lyon. Vous pouvez aussi participer. Ma première question est comment Tarsot, le secrétaire de contact General from Le Hun, to advise them of the meeting. Le Hun, Do you know how that came about? Une réunion. Savez -vous? Response. Réponse. Things had already been underway and I am not aware of how Les the communication was changed. Enfin, en Again, how people communicated, I don't know. Je ne sais pas comment les gens prenaient contact. Um, that's understandable. Um, how did you know about the meeting? Do you remember? Comment avez-vous entendu parler de cette réunion? Si vous vous en souvenez. Response. Réponse. On my side, the Lonol side, de mon côté, le, de la there were partie, enfin, dans le camp de people who still could uh, communicate. Il y avait des I gens mean, there, qui there was line of communication and we talked to one another to come to a meeting at the provincial hall. Et mm. I, I, I just followed them. But I just did not know how uh, they communicated with the other side, uh, so that they could get gathered at the meeting all together. I understand, and that line of communication <coughs> between the Lonol and the Hun. I understand, and that line of communication between the Lonol soldiers. Are you aware whether that line of communication existed throughout the province, or uh, was it limited to certain areas and, and units? certaines aires géographiques. Response. Réponse. This line of communication on the Lonol administrative part, uh, it was still in place. Au sein des, du so camp de Lonol they était still en place. had uh, this line of communi communication um, operational Donc so that people could still communiquer. talk to one another les gens pouvaient se parler et dire qu'il fallait aller au bureau provincial. Et en termes de ce qui était dit aux soldats de Lonol, vous savez si cette communication était dit pour tous les Lonol soldats de cette réunion Le message avait-il été envoyé à des districts les soldats de toute la province, units. à certains districts ou simplement was it à certaines unités. To a group, or was that invitation cette invitation à participer to the meeting, à la réunion était-elle limitée à all certains groupes soldiers ou était-elle à l'attention de tous les soldats de l'ONOL de, de la région? Response. Réponse. The invitation was sent to the people uh, across or throughout the province. A été envoyé Thank you. You mentioned um, that there were about 500 attendees, 500 attendees and you stated that um, some were soldiers, civil servants and students of the Lonol, Lonol regime. Des du can, regime you, de can you tell us how many of that 500 were Lonol soldiers? Sur les 500 des Approximately. Plus ou moins. Response. Response. The majority of them were the former Lonol officials. La plupart d'entre eux étaient d'anciens fonctionnaires de Lonol. Et nous pouvons regarder les spectateurs de Lonol. Il était le gouverneur de la province. Mais il était aussi un militaire. Donc, ses subordonnés ont toujours suivi ses instructions. Et je pense que ces subordonnés devaient obéir à ses ordres. 
these people still followed such instruction seriously Et and also there were some students and also teachers uh, who suivi les ordres il y avait aussi des people. étudiants des enseignants qui faisaient partie de ces 500 personnes uh, okay just just to be clear Um, in your statement, you said um, there were soldiers, civil servants, and students attending, and then you've just testified that um, the majority were Blondnod officials who were subordinate to General Prum Lehorn. So my question is, when you say that they were uh, Blondnod officials, the majority, are you saying they were long, majority Lon Nol soldiers or majority Lon Nol um, other type of official? Just so we're clear. Response. I am talking about uh, uh, the mixture of uh, people Réponse. including Je civilians des... and soldiers il y a plusieurs types de personnes tant des civils que des militaires and just to, to finally clarify pour que of ce that soit 500 clair, are you able to estimate about how many were soldiers combien étaient des soldats london soldiers de london Response. Réponse. According to my estimation, there were more than 200 London soldiers. D'après mes estimations, il y en avait plus de 200. <coughs> you mentioned that Question. you worked in the uh, provincial office vous nous avez dit um, que of, vous the, avez of the military in the SAT. Bureau provincial euh, militaire de Pursat. Did you uh, know any of these 200 soldiers or approximately 200 soldiers soldats, that, at that meeting? Ces 200 soldats qui étaient au, à la réunion. Response. I knew a lot of them. Réponse. J'en connaissais beaucoup. And were the soldiers wearing uniforms or not? Et les soldats portaient-ils l'uniforme ou non? Response. On the 17th of Réponse. April, when everyone was disarmed, avril, we were no longer wearing the uniforms. Il, tout le monde a été désarmé. Nous ne portions plus l'uniforme. Can you approximately say, Question. of the 200 soldiers Question. you believe were there, Les about how many you là? knew? Either closely or soldats, donc, um, as an acquaintance, just an approximate. Que ce soit des amis proches ou de simples connaissances. Response. Réponse. I still recall the senior. Je me souviens. Uh, chiefs of soldiers including the de general and other généraux, second rank officials uh, from the general ranks and I knew fairly a lot of them de rang secondaire, at least uh, 10 to 20 plusieurs, of them beaucoup même, entre 10 et 20. thank you and um, To be clear, um, did these soldiers, the, the ones that, um, that were at the meeting, did they come from different units, different military units, or did they come from one military unit or a couple within the Lon Nol army? Response. These soldiers were Ces from different military units throughout the country. They were all pays. collected uh, from these 
various parts of the country. Ils avaient été rassemblés de ces différents endroits du pays. And, and when you say country, are you, do you mean various parts pays, of the, the province or the province? Um, an area greater than that, or do you mean the whole country? Ou voulez-vous vraiment dire le pays au complet? Réponse. Response. No, I, I think um, uh, uh, I am referring only to the uh, people who were gathered from throughout the province of Poussaint. Thank you very much. That's uh, very clear. Uh, within the 500 people, uh, were there any women? Response. Réponse. I saw mainly men in the meeting. J'ai vu surtout des no hommes. Women. Je n'ai pas vu de femmes. You mentioned that uh, Khmer Rouge soldiers were guarding outside of the meeting. Um, about how many Khmer Rouge soldiers, soldiers were doing la garde that? À la réunion. Combien de soldats Khmer Rouge montaient la garde? Response. Réponse. As I guess, uh, there could be 50 to 60 people. 50 to 60. I think there are. And you also mentioned that there were Khmer Rouge um, chiefs at the meeting. Uh, one of them being Tarsot, the sector secretary. How did you know that the others? Were Khmer Rouge chiefs Comment avez-vous su que les autres étaient des chefs Khmer Rouge the meeting. et qui avaient participé à la réunion Response. Réponse. It was not difficult to identify them because they were reconnaître. wearing black uniforms and they were noir. armed. Et and on our side, aussi. no one was armed. Donc, de notre camp, personne n'avait d'armes. About um, how many Khmer Rouge chiefs were there? You refer to your statement. Question. Uh, Combien de you chefs Khmer Rouge? Were, uh, Khmer Rouge chiefs. About how many Khmer chiefs Khmer were there? Environ. Response. Response. There were about five to seven top leaders of the Khmer Rouge, and I only recognized a person by the name of Tassot, who was also the secretary of the sector. And the, the provincial um, office that you met at, um, is that still standing today, the structure? In Ce bâtiment existe-t-il toujours à Poursat? Response. Réponse. Yes, it is. Oui. The whole complex uh, remains uh, intact. Le bâtiment est toujours là. And can you briefly describe it? Was it one or two stories? Um, did it have a, a, a fence around it? Can you briefly explain what it looked like? Autour, pouvez-vous nous expliquer et nous décrire? Response. Réponse. During the meeting, the provincial hall was still la réunion, small, le but now the petit, building was expanded, or is expanded, and il est uh, plus gros, the complex is now bigger, et c est, c est plus gros but uh, the Grand Hotel is still the Mais same as it used to be, comme il était avant. but uh, the other military complex for the general chief of staff Et has already been removed. On a retiré and le now qui the other building is housing the. Aujourd'hui, dans le bâtiment, 
the land management uh, department. Le département de gestion des terres. Thank you. You mentioned that 500 Question. attended. Vous dites que 500 personnes ont participé. All of the 500 est -il fit possible, in est -il the provincial building, tout... or were some spilling out ces personnes, uh, outside as well? Est-il possible pour toutes ces personnes d'être dans le bâtiment ou dans la salle, ou est-ce que ça débordait à l'extérieur? Response. Réponse. Not all the 500 people were fit uh, non, into the whole complex. Uh, some of them les were seen outside euh, because there are too many people pas to fit in one place at the same de la salle, donc il y en avait qui étaient à l'extérieur. How long did the, the meeting last Combien de temps before la the attendees durée? left? Avant que les participants ne repartent. Response. Réponse. The meeting took for about two to three hours before a duré deux ou trois heures. an agreement was reached uh, and that uh, avant qu'une entente soit Everyone had finalement to conclue. Meet again the following day so that they could be sent all together to see le lendemain pour qu'ils soient envoyés so tous ensemble pour the aller meeting voir was convened and then the following day they were loaded le onto trucks uh, to receive pour aller pour accueillir to meet Anka. pour aller rencontrer Anka. Can you um, describe a bit more the content of the meeting? Oui, vous nous uh, you la said réunion. that it uh, occurred for two to three hours. A duré deux ou trois heures. And you've said to the investigators that um, the content of the meeting was an invitation to receive the anchor at Tulpo Tray. What was discussed in those two to three hours? In the meeting, they educated us Question. about the policy of reconciliation nous ont la and about de reconciliation. Ils ont parlé de la construction and lastly, du pays. they spoke about Et enfin, placing our trust in Ils ont dit going for the reception que nous devions avoir confiance that was their approach so that we would trust them à cette in réception general, we did not know what's going to happen in the near future avoir confiance de façon générale But nous ne savions pas ce que l'avenir proche nous réservait mais nous savons tous donner notre accord pour aller à cette réception and who was the reception um, to be with? Il s'agissait d'une réception uh, avec Again, qui? where was the location of that reception? You said it was at Tulpo Tray. Où devait avoir lieu cette réception? Where was Vous dites que c'était à Tulpo Tray in relation to où the se provincial hall? Tulpo Tray. About par how far away was it? Au siège des autorités provinciales. Approximativement. Tulpo Tray was about Tulpo 20 kilometers away it was toward the Kandyan district dans le district de Kandyan and can you give some more detail Question. about um, what was going to happen at Tulpo Tray what que you were told se was à going to happen d'après ce qu'on vous a dit When we were gathered uh, to go to Tour Pochrey, that is in the reception of Anka, I personally agreed to go too, but then the car that I traveled on was stopped halfway. La voiture dans laquelle j'étais s'est arrêtée à mi-chemin. 
In fact, I wanted to, to go on that car, but because it was uh, fully loaded, I was told to go in a later mais comme vehicle. Elle était pleine, on dit autre so autre I myself did suivant. not reach Tulpo Trey. However, three days later, I heard tard, that those people had been killed. Thank you, and I'm, I'm going to ask you some, some questions about what happened to you and um, how you found out um, that people were killed at Tulpo Trey. But perhaps if we can just go a little bit slower and so we can understand a little more. Par étape pour mieux comprendre. When you were at the meeting, Quand vous étiez à la réunion, you were told that there was an invitation to receive Angkor at Tulpo Trey. Um, who did you think invité à rencontrer Angkor was Tulpo when you heard that? Quand vous avez entendu cela, selon vous, qui était Lankar? Thank you for that question. Réponse. Merci pour la question. To recollect the event in terms of Anka, we never heard of Anka while we worked for the administrative side. Quand nous travaillions so we were told that we would go and greet Anka and we wanted to meet Anka. Jamais entendu parler de Lankar. Là, on nous a dit que nous allions rencontrer Lankar et nous voulions le faire. We en effet, another, après la réconciliation, nous espérions que nous pourrions unir But nos forces pour I construire le pays. Mais je n'ai jamais su qui était Lankar. Um, did you think Ankar was a, a person Selon vous, est-ce que Lankar était une personne ou un groupe de personnes Réponse. In fact, I did not understand en réalité, who Anka was. je ne comprenais pas qui était Lankar. C'est pour cela que je voulais aller was. avec les autres pour savoir qui était Lankar. As a, Question. A Lon -Nol soldier en tant que soldat de Lonol um, qui avait Rouge combattu troops, les troupes were you in fear at that time when you attended the meeting? Or Aviez -vous peur were you à feeling réunion? optimistic Ou bien que that uh, things would improve, security would improve, and peace would come to Pesat? How were you feeling when you attended that meeting and à cette réunion, you heard this discussion about an invitation for reconciliation and meeting Ankar? À la réconciliation ainsi que d'une réception avec l'Ankar? In fact, Réponse. it was the feeling of uh, being fed up of engaging in the war. The only thing that we wanted at that time la was peace. Tout ce que nous voulions, c'était la paix. So at that time, I could not imagine uh, that something bad would happen. Je ne pas m'imaginer que quelque chose de négatif ne puisse se produire. J'étais très optimiste. Ourselves. Je pensais que nous pourrions rassembler nos forces. And at that meeting, over the two to three hours, Question. were you conversing, were you talking to other Lonnol soldiers? And if you were, de Lonnol, can you give us uh, an impression of what you think they thought of the situation? Qu'est-ce que pensaient de la situation Est-ce que les autres avaient like peur yourself? ou bien étaient-ils optimistes comme vous Ceci uniquement si vous avez pu parler avec ces gens et vous forger un avis à ce sujet. The majority Réponse. had the same opinion la as I had. Des autres avaient le même avis que moi. For that reason, They gathered up in order to meet with Ankar. C'est pour cela qu'ils se sont rassemblés pour aller rencontrer l'Ankar. Thank you. Question. Now, just um, to understand, um, did you know uh, what was at Tulpo Trey before 
that meeting? Que vous did you know of the location of Tulpo Trey? Did you know où était if there were any buildings or there was any um, vous saviez si là-bas il y avait a site there of un note? bâtiment ou un site particulier quelconque? During that meeting, I myself did not know Tulpo Chray when Lors de cette referred to réunion, quand on a parlé de Tulpo Chray, moi je ne connaissais pas cet endroit. Was there um, a Lonnol military base at uh, Tulpo Chray? Y avait-il une base militaire de Lonnol à Tulpo Chray? To my knowledge, réponse. later on, very close to Tulpo Chray, there was a Lonnol military tout près de Tulpo Chray, il y avait une base militaire de Lonnol. And how many Question. Uh, soldiers were stationed there? Combien de Did soldats you know? étaient stationnés sur place? Le saviez-vous? Right. Réponse. In the military term, there were about uh, three groups which formed uh, one platoon. They were the un peloton en termes militaires. Avant-garde group. C'était le groupe d'avant-garde. And about how many Question. people were in that group, if you can say? Ce groupe était constitué d'environ combien de personnes Réponse. There were about 30 soldiers. It was between 30 to 40 soldiers. D'entre 30 et 40 soldats. Now, earlier you said before the Khmer Question. Rouge took control Vous avez dit of uh, the province, que les Khmer Rouge ne there were battlefields de la province um, de Pursat. throughout Il y avait des champs de the province dans toute cette um, province. before April 75. Et ce, avril Do you know whether at Tulpo Trey, shortly before the Khmer Rouge Juste took control, que les Khmer was there a battlefield there le or not? De la province, if you know, est-ce que vous savez um, s'il y avait or, or des combats à Tulpo Trey? Le savez-vous? To my knowledge, Réponse. that location à ma was a fierce battlefield à cet endroit, between il y avait the Khmer Rouge force and the Lonnol soldiers. Entre les forces Khmer Rouge et les soldats de Lonnol. And Question. was the battle between, as far as you know, and if you don't say so, à votre was the battle between those 30 soldiers pas, approximately, or was it with more Lonnol soldiers? d'un combat contre ces 30 soldats ou contre des forces plus importantes de l'armée de Lonnol? Was a Cette base militaire a front line de Lonnol point between était the sur le front and the Khmer Rouge forces. opposant les forces Khmer Rouge aux forces and de Lonnol. You know, um, how many people were fighting on that front line vous combien il y avait de combattants sur cette ligne de front avant avril 1975 so. Si vous ne le savez pas, il suffira de l'indiquer. It was about these Réponse. three squads who actually occupied that advanced post Environ at that location. Occupaient ce poste avancé. So then they would transmit the information through Les the bag if there was an encroachment or advancement by the Khmer Rouge forces. Si les forces Khmer Rouge Thank you. Du terrain. And of the 200 Question. 
Parmi les environ 200 soldats qui étaient présents à cette réunion, savez-vous si ces 30 de Tulpo Trey étaient présents également Pourriez-vous répéter la question You said that there were 30 soldiers based at Tulpo Trey. Did you know whether they were at the meeting at the provincial hall or not? À la réunion qui s'est tenue au siège de l'administration provinciale. Yes, indeed. Réponse. They attended the meeting. Ils y étaient. Thank you. Question. Now, I'd like to take you to your statement um, where you talk about um, the end of the meeting. And if I quote at uh, English 0024-2126, Khmer 0019-6811-12, and French 0027-4132, um, you state and you continue on from the meeting and you state, at that time, they had the Passat provincial governor, soldiers, former civil servants and students of Lon Nol's regime get on trucks to receive Angkor. They were transported out by 13 or 15 white vehicles, trucks manufactured in Australia, about 500, including Mr. Prom Lahun, got into the trucks to Tulpo Trey. As it was so crowded in the trucks, they asked me to wait for the next trip. There was a fairly large number of people who missed the first trip. Now, if I can ask you a few questions about that, when, when your statement is read, it appears that lecture, as soon as the meeting was over, réunion, the soldiers, civil servants soldats, and students who attended at the meeting, it appears that you're saying réunion, that they got onto the trucks um, straight away, straight after the meeting. And yet earlier, you've said that um, the meeting finished dit, and it was the next day that avait people went back et que ce to the provincial hall que le and que got on the trucks. Can you think pour dans les um, clearly, I know it was Veuillez a long time ago, je sais que cela à longtemps, but did people get on the trucks mais immediately que les gens sont after dans les the meeting finished, après la réunion? or did, um, was there a night in between and people came back the next day. Fait le lendemain. If you can't remember, just say so. But if you can clarify that, that would be helpful to the chamber. Il serait utile que vous précisiez cela si vous êtes en mesure de le faire. Through my knowledge. The meeting in order to à ma go and receive Ankar cette réunion consacrée à la réception et à l'accueil de l'Ankar a eu lieu and à un moment the events distinct. that people bought the, the, the tracks. There was a, another meeting and immediately after the meeting Quand people would board the trucks. Quand les gens sont des camions, c'était juste and après une autre time, réunion. There were a lot of people Cette fois-là, il y avait beaucoup de monde. The trucks could not accommodate all the people. Il n'y avait pas de place pour and tous dans le camion. Before people boarded the trucks, there was a meeting held and Avant they would board the trucks straight away after the meeting dans le concluded. Camion, il y avait eu une réunion et juste après celle-ci, les gens sont montés à bord du camion. Tracks, were en route, there were still people who Alors were still le camion était en standing route. alongside the road in order to, to wait for the truck to stop so then they could board the, the truck. 
many many people wanted to go Beaucoup so they, they rushed to to board the truck il uh, se hâtait de monter à bord du camion and some people even ran up ran after Certains the, the tracks. Ont même I was couru après trying to climb onto the track as well, Moi but aussi, I was uh, de off. À bord, mais on and just let me repeat again, and Laissez before people boarded the track, there was a meeting, and people camion, would straight away réunion, get onto the track. Après les gens and sont those people who boarded the tracks, they packed their own meal. With and brought along with them. Avec eux, leur Thank repas. you. I think that's clearer now. So you're saying that, Merci. in Je fact, crois qu there were two clair. meetings Donc, at the provincial hall. Au siège One which de um, discussed this issue. And then shortly after, or the following ah, day, réunion, um, there was another meeting. Et peu après, ou and main, immediately after réunion. that meeting, people réunion, got onto the trucks. Is that camions. correct? Yes, exact. Yes, that is correct. Réponse. C'est exact. <coughs> Did you go to Question. both meetings or just the aux deux meeting um, in which um, à celle people left and got onto the trucks? Après laquelle les gens ont monté à bord des camions. Okay, bon. Réponse. I attended the meeting where I tried to get onto the track. À la réunion à laquelle j'ai essayé de monter à bord du camion. So to be clear, um, question. You only attended one of the two meetings. Vous assisté qu'à une de ces deux réunions meetings. ou bien aux deux réunions. The meeting that I attended Réponse. first was to receive the information. La réunion à laquelle j'ai d'abord assisté visait à recevoir des informations. And we were told about uh, going to Tulpo Chirai. On nous a dit que nous and irions à Tulpo Chirai. And then on the second meeting, everyone was prepared réunion, in order to go on that trip. Tout le monde était déjà prêt à partir. But we all knew about the trip from the information nous that étions we au received. De ce voyage après avoir Because reçu des informations dans ce sens, nous essayons d'obtenir des informations et de suivre de près l'évolution de la situation. Thank you. And, and from your evidence this morning, Question. Um, it appears that you were saying that people were very matin, eager to get onto the trucks. Les gens étaient désireux de monter à bord des camions. Ils voulaient correct? y aller. Est-ce exact? Yes, that is correct. Réponse. C'est exact. You mentioned that Question. there were about 500 people Vous dites at this meeting before they got onto the trucks. Il y avait about how many uh, were left behind que ces gens ne and dans missed the camions. first trip? Combien de ces gens like yourself? Ont raté le premier camion comme vous et sont restés sur place. Question. Question. Witness, please wait. Uh, le Coupé, le président. Proceed. Et moi, je vais attendre la parole de la défense. Uh, la défense. Mr. Merci. I think the prosecutor is je pense not representing que l'accusation déforme les propos du témoin. Apparemment, celui-ci a dit qu'à la première réunion, il y avait eu 500 personnes. And, uh, we have no idea how many people were on ne sait pas combien de gens il y avait à la deuxième so réunion. To be very clear on, il faut que l'on soit au clair quant à ce qui a eu lieu à la première et à la deuxième réunion. Il ne faut um, pas les confondre. I think the prosecutor at this stage should be Ici, asking more open questions. L'accusation devrait poser des questions plus ouvertes sur les deux réunions. Um, l'accusation. Your Honor, if I can briefly respond, I mean, brièvement répondre. the witness has said that um, le témoin the 500 people went to the first meeting and they came back à la première réunion, to the second après quoi, ils sont um, allés à la deuxième uh, réunion. The, referring to the 500. Visiblement, But il parlait des mêmes to, 500 personnes. To, to assist in clarity, Mais I, I will pour que les choses soient plus claires, um, je vais obtenir des précisions sur le nombre de personnes qui sont allées à la deuxième réunion and if in fact they were the same pour voir s'il s'agissait des mêmes personnes, comme l'a dit le témoin. 
Um, Mr. Mr. Som, Monsieur Som, I think you heard that. Je pense um, que vous avez entendu you said ce at débat. The first meeting, à la première uh, réunion, there were 500 ce que vous avez dit, il y avait 500 personnes. About 200 of them, 200 uh, d'entre eux environ were soldiers, étaient des soldats. And, um, you knew some of them. Vous en connaissiez certains. Then, at the second Ensuite, meeting, can you tell us concernant whether, la deuxième réunion, um, it was Will tell us how many people attended the second Combien meeting compared to the first. Y était par rapport à la première réunion. Réponse. The number of the attendees in the second meeting was no different from those people who attended the first meeting. Réunion, le nombre de participants était le même qu'à la première réunion. Thank you. You mentioned in your statement that um, it was so crowded in the trucks, they asked me to wait for the next trip. And there were fa fairly large number of people who missed the first trip. Can you approximate how many people missed the first trip, like yourself? Réponse. I cannot give you the exact Je peux pas number, vous donner de chiffres exacts, but a portion of the people missed the tracks like, like myself. Raté la camion, At that time, comme moi. the situation was rather chaotic, so I could not figure out the exact number of the people who missed the trip. Je ne pouvais pas savoir exactement combien de gens avaient raté le premier voyage. You said that Question. to the investigators that there were 13 enquêteurs. or 15 vous avez dit qu'il y avait entre 13 et 15 About camions. How many people, um, did you see get on each truck Combien de gens environ avez-vous vu monter à bord du premier camion From what Réponse. I saw, each D'après ce que j'ai vu, was fully chaque camion loaded. était plein. And some people try to climb onto the truck as well, that, de but then they were pushed off. Mais ils étaient repoussés. Um, if you can't, Question. don't. But can you approximate how many people dire got on each truck? De personnes environ About how many? Sont montés dans chaque camion. Si vous n'êtes pas en mesure de le faire, il suffira de l'indiquer. Referring to Réponse. the size of the truck, and that was uh, the kind of trucks that were manufactured in Australia. Des camions de fabrication australienne. We can uh, work something out uh, together. De leur taille, on peut faire un calcul the ensemble. trucks were uh, wide, and uh, de gros camions. they were net on the side of the trucks, and it was uh, a pretty large truck. C'était d'assez grands camions. Can you, I'll try one last time, can you approximate how many people Question. you saw got on each truck? Environ combien de gens avez-vous vu monter à bord de chaque camion? It could be between 50 to 60 per truck. Entre 50 et 60 personnes par camion. And why do you remember in particular that they were trucks uh, made in Australia? Question. Comment savez-vous que c'était des camions de fabrication australienne? L'interprète précise que le témoin a dit que les camions étaient bâchés. Sur le côté. I recall it clearly because those trucks were uh, donated by Australia through the military. Été donné par l'Australie à l'armée. Thank you.
the direction, Question. firstly, did you see the trucks uh, leave Avez -vous uh, vu the les provincial camions hall? Quitter le siège did they leave de um, singularly? Les camions or did they leave in a convoy? Un par un, ou en convoy? And which direction did they head? Quelle direction ont-ils emprunté? On departure from the provincial Réponse. town, they left in a column Ils and they were chased by those people who were leaving. Le siège du gouvernement provincial. They traveled along Les gens poussaient river, des cris d'exclamation. Les camions sont passés par la rivière Poursat et ensuite vers Toul Pochrey. So they did not travel one by one, Les but camions they traveled in a column pas fait of vehicles. le voyage un par un. Il s'agissait d'une colonne de véhicules. Now, Question. Um, you, you said that, um, you couldn't fit on the truck. Vous dites que vous n'avez pas pu prendre place dans le camion. Earlier this morning that, Ce matin, um, you got on a truck vous avez aussi dit got off a truck. être monté dans un camion puis en être descendu. Can you explain, pour bien comprendre um, whether you Got on one of those expliquer si vous êtes monté à bord d'un des camions and then got off, pour ensuite en descendre or were you not able to get ou bien on one si of those vous n'avez pas pu monter à bord d'un de ces camions never got on. à aucun moment. It was the seventh or the eighth track that I Réponse. requested uh, to, to get on. J'ai demandé à embarquer dans le septième ou le huitième camion, said, mais ils m'ont refusé. Ils m'ont repoussé en disant so d'attendre le prochain. I did not mind at the time à l'époque, ça ne me get dérangeait on, pas but, uh, tant que je puisse monter dans un camion, full. mais à chaque fois, on me repoussait car President. le camion était plein. Thank you, le the prosecution, and thank you, Merci Mr. Witness. au procureur et au témoin. Nous allons observer une pause de 20 minutes. L'audience reprendra à 11h moins 10. Court officer, Officier d'audience, veuillez vous occuper du témoin the durant la pause and have him et le ramener dans le prétoire pour la reprise de l'audience à 10h50. Ceci vaut également pour l'avocat du témoin. Recess. Suspension de l'audience.